walk through this darkness and still do at times, to be quite honest, have issues in our family, just like every family, that we have to make choices to love like we've never been hurt. We can play religious games and we can play Christianity or we can get real and understand that it's impossible. The Bible said through much tribulation will you enter the kingdom of heaven, which means you're going to go through it. You're going to be hurt. You're going to be offended. You're going to be betrayed. You're going to hurt people. You're going to say things that you should have never said in fits of anger. And when you do, when you receive those words and when you give those words and when the enemy comes to attack your own kin and your own blood and try to divide and conquer your family, the only remedy is to love like you've never been hurt. Hi, I'm Ramonda Bacon, founder of Sister Sow and See. I put a book in my spirit to share with you. I purchased this book in particular about a year ago, last year, and my schedule was just so busy and I was reading other material that I didn't get the opportunity to read this book. So I picked up this book January 2022 and I began to read it. And it really touched my soul because I feel that it's something that we all face. We've all faced disappointment. We've all faced hurt. Um, we've all have maybe heard words that have been spoken or said toward us that we know that wasn't of God, but we we have held on to those words. And uh, so I began to read this book and it really just spoke to my heart. Journey with me, journey with me on finding out how to love like we've never been hurt. Be free, I want to be free that this will not bound us. Whatever the encounter, the hurt was that we experienced, that it won't bound us from walking freely in the gifts that God has given us and also in the purpose that he has ordained for our lives. Because I believe that the enemy wants us to hold on to this baggage, these things. But God wants us to let go and just to love. How to love like we've never been hurt. Let's experience Jesus together. Um, I'm so excited. So if you want to partake in this class, I may not have your email address, but you can send me an instant message and send me your information. We will do this by way of Zoom because I know that there are sisters that are not here locally in California that may want to join us. So we'll do it by way of Zoom. We will meet on a bi-weekly basis to discuss uh, probably like two chapters every time we meet. And um, we will begin in May. Excuse me, March. March. We will begin next month in March. And I'm excited. I'm excited for what God is going to do. I, I feel like this is for all of us and for whoever has walked through this and they're good and you're, you're not hurting anymore. Share your testimony with us. Share how you made it through, you know? Um, that's what Sister Sewing Seeds is about. Accountability Sisters, about finding ways to really unite together as daughters of Christ and encourage and esteem one another to keep running this race that God has called us to run. So let's, let's dig in this book together and let's be strengthened together by his word. Um, God is good, and I hope to see your beautiful face on Sister Silencey's book club, Love Like You've Never Been Heard Zoom Call. God bless you, my sister. I pray this year is treating you well. Happy New Year's to you. I know it's late, but happy New Year's to you. God bless you. And I am back, and I'm so excited about Sister Silencey's 2022 2.0, that God has great things in store and I thank him for what he's done and what he's going to do. God bless you, my sister. Love you so much. Hope to see you soon. It's never wrong to love. It's never out of order to love. You're never compromising when you love. You're not lowering your standards when you love. Love never fails.